Hello, and welcome to More Than Just Friends, short videos on single functions of Mannequin's Just Friends Manifold Generator module. In the first installment, Flume, the FMVCO you didn't know you had. Before Flume gets a proper exploration, let's define Manifold Generator in the context of Just Friends by breaking down both words. Manifold for various, many, or multiple, and generator for thing that generates something. Just Friends creates frequencies both below and within the range of human hearing for either CV or oscillator use. Manifold representations of the audio spectrum as generated by circuitry. And with that out of the way, it's time to get closer to your new friends. Flume is the alternative run mode of the cycle sound switch settings. While cycle sound would normally allow basic VCO use as a harmonic oscillator, wave-shaped oscillator, and other additive synthesis options, by plugging a cable in at run, the core is broken open into a two-operator FM VCO with options for wideband noise. That sounds simple enough, but this is a mannequin's module, so things get much deeper quickly. Run is a fascinating little input allowing for differences across a negative 5 volt to positive 5 volt range with a set definition for 0 volts. I'm fortunate enough to own a version 1 Just Friends, the one with the silver clouds, which means I have to plug the cable into Run before its source to avoid shorting the source. However, I find this to be a better way to use this input regardless of the iteration you own. By using a dummy cable, you set the CV to 0, which lets one explore the base of each alternate Run mode while forcing the user to really consider where a control voltage will be sourced from. Flume uses run to set the ratio of modulators versus carriers, so at a full negative 5 volts the modulator will be half the frequency of a given carrier, full 5 volts yields a 2 to 1 ratio, and nothing evens them out to an equal frequency. Working in conjunction with run voltages, the FM knob controls the depth equally from noon to full clockwise and proportionally to the output coefficient when counterclockwise before noon, meaning identity will not be FM'd while 6N will be fully modulated. Before we get into some sounds, the last point to be aware of is that CV at FM in controls the depth of frequency modulation, with negative voltages inverting modulators before the carrier enters the picture for more fun when using the ramp controls. With all that out of the way, let's get to the good stuff. Here we're sequencing from the melody mill, and the audio is direct out from Just Friends. Patch identity out to a VCA, then a VCF, or use ripples for both at the same time, like in this example, to set up a basic subtractive situation. Now, using the same envelope to control both, add a third iteration to the FM input jack. I'm sending a constant voltage from Maths channel 3 to run, but any source works as long as you can control the amount in order to get the right ratios. Now we're sending a sequence from Ableton Live to the volt per octave of Just Friends with each note triggering one channel of a dual ADSR. Have a listen. Perhaps the most outré but useful feature of Flume is its ability to create full-spectrum noise. Getting there is simple. Put run at any voltage between negative 5 and 0 volts, put the FM knob full clockwise, and turn ramp either all the way up or all the way down. Monitor the output for mix, and you will find broadband noise shouting back, its timbral quality suggested by curve, ramp, and intone.
While noise is omnipresent, the wisps of fundamentals can sometimes be discerned at outputs, which means some CV of FM, run, and ramp can yield FM drums that morph from tonal goodness to noisy glory. wraps it up. Hopefully you have a better idea of what Flume can do and how it can help create a synth voice, a drum, a noise source, or just a playground for experimentation. Comment on what other functions of Just Friends you'd want covered and have a wonderful day.